Here, I have for you a clone question based on the year 2005. Okay. Express log 125p over 9 base p in terms of m and n. Now, like I said earlier, this kind of questions, when you get this type of questions, this number, what you get here, break it up into these numbers. 3, 5, and P. Okay? 3, 5, and the base P. So, this is how it works. This is equal to, now you break it up. Log 1, 2, 5, base P. Times means plus log P base p divide so you minus log 9 base p okay now what is 1 to 5 5 cube log 5 cube base p plus log p base p is 1 minus log 3 square base p Okay, next step, we bring the power forward using the law of logarithm. Bring it forward. So what do we get? So when you bring forward, you get 3 log 5. 3 log 5. Okay, base P plus 1 minus 2 log 3 base p. Got it? Okay. This is equal to what is log 5 base p? Log 5 base p is n. So 3n plus 1 minus 2 times log 3 base p. What is log 3 base p? m. So we substitute m. This is your answer in terms of M and N. I hope you have got it. It's not very difficult. Practice. Learn and practice. Thank you. In this question, you are supposed to express P in terms of Q. Now, like I said, generally, questions on logarithms, you try and combine two or three logs into a single log and then do comparison. Okay, let's see how this is done. Okay, if you look carefully, log PQ base 3 is equal to now. This we convert to log base 3. So this will be log 3 cube. That is 27 base 3. 3 cube is 27. 3 can be written like this. Like this. See log 3 cube base 3. If you bring forward, it is 3 times log 3 base 3. This is 1. So in the same way, the reverse, you bring the 3 up here, you get 27. 3 cube, okay, plus, bring this forward here, log P squared base 3 minus log Q, okay, minus log Q, right. Let me erase this. Okay, 
Now we're going to combine all these into a single log. So if you look carefully, log PQ base 3. Now you must not be lazy to write all the steps. It is important in mathematics. You patiently write the steps. Okay? Now we combine this equal to log plus, so we multiply. 27P squared. 27 times P squared. Minus divide Q. Base 3. Okay, now if you look carefully, if you look carefully, you compare both sides equal base 3, base 3, therefore PQ is equal to this. 27P squared over Q. PQ is equal to 27P squared over Q. Right. Have we got it until here? Now, the next step. The next step. Watch very carefully the next step. Okay. Q goes up here. This Q. You multiply with this. The P comes down here. The 27 comes down here. Follow the arrows. Follow the arrows. Okay? So let's see what happens now. Q times Q equals to P squared over P. This is over 27. Now let me write it for you again properly. This. Now watch carefully. So you get Q times Q over 27 equals to P squared over P. If you follow these arrows properly, see, P comes down, Q goes up, 27 comes down here. This is what you get. So now you get Q squared over 27 equals to Cancel, you get P. But you don't leave the answer like this because you are asked to write P in terms of Q. So the subject is P. Subject must always be on the left, on your left. So therefore, P is equal to Q squared over 27. This is your answer. P in terms of Q. I hope... You have got it? Step by step, you are sure to arrive at the answer. Always double check your steps as you do. Okay? It is good practice. Right? Thank you. Hi. Here, I have for you another clone question based on the year 2006. Here, you are supposed to solve this and find the value of Y. Now, like I said earlier, many questions in SPM, you combine a few different logs into a single log. And Use comparison and get the answer. Okay? Now let's see what we can do here. 3 plus log y minus 2 base 2 equals to log y minus 4 base 2. Alright. Now we convert this into log. Base is 2. So, if you look carefully, log 2 base 2 is 1. You want to get 3. Power 3. See? 2 to the power of 3 is 8. So, 8. Log 8 base 2. This is 3. If you look carefully, yeah? this one. Right. Plus log y minus 2 base 2 equals to log 
y minus 4 base 2. Now we combine these two log into a single log. So log plus, so you times, times y minus 2 base 2 equals to log y minus 4 base 2. Okay, you got it under here? Now you do comparison. You compare, see, 2 equals to log equals to log. So this 8 times y minus 2 equals to y minus 4. Very simple. Therefore, 8 bracket y minus 2 equals to y minus 4. So you be open it up. 8y minus 16 equals to y minus 4. Okay, you've got it under here? Got it? Good. Now, let's go further. Plus y, bring to this side. Minus y. 8y minus y. 7y equals to Negative 16, bring to the other side, is positive. Negative 4 plus 16. Negative 4 plus 16. So how much is that? That is 12. 7y equals to 12. Bring the 7 down. y equals to 12 over 7. That is your answer. The value of y. Now, learn the techniques and practice. Even if you know the techniques, huh, but you are lazy, you will not score an A. If you want to score an A, you must be committed. You must practice. Once you practice, you can do it, I assure you. Don't let anybody tell you you cannot do additional mathematics. You can do it. Learn the steps and practice Practice, practice, practice makes perfect. Thank you.